Hi kindergartners, this is Miss Moses. I'm here for our Thursday morning phonics lesson. And today we are going to practice reading some sentences. So by the end of our lesson, students will be able to read sentences and draw a picture to match. So you're going to read the sentence and draw a picture that matches the sentence to show that you understand what it means. So I'll show you first with two sentences how I tap out and read them and then draw a picture that matches the sentence. Then we'll do some together and then there will be some for you to do by yourself. Let's get started. Okay, so if I want to read this sentence, first I need to find the sight words that I know so that I know which words I need to tap out and which words I'll just know by looking at them. This is the sight word I. This is the sight word, the. So I already know those two words. The other words I'll have to tap out to read. I will read when I come to a word I don't know. I'll tap it out. Then I'll go back to the beginning of the sentence and read fluently. I'm trying to really be a fluent reader. Watch me read. I, s, w, i, m, swim. I swim in, in, I swim in the, oh, a, k, lake. I got it. I swim in the lake. Wow, I read that whole sentence. Now I need to draw a picture that matches the sentence. This sentence said, I swim in the lake. So I'm going to draw a picture of myself swimming in a lake. There's my lake. Those are my waves. I drew a picture of me swimming in the lake. My picture matches the sentence. It wouldn't have made sense if I drew a picture of me sitting at a table because it's not, the sentence does not say, I sit at the table. The sentence says, I swim in the lake. So I had to draw a picture of me swimming in a lake. Watch me read this sentence and then draw a picture that matches. First, I'll find my sight words and I'll put them in a box. That word says, I, S-E-E-C. -E -E so I have I, C, M, Y, my. Okay, so I know my sight words. I, C, and my. Oh, there's only one word I'll have to tap out by myself. I can read this sentence. I, C, my, N, A, M, name. Got it. I, C, my, name. I tapped out that whole sentence by myself. Now I can draw a picture to match. So I'm going to draw a picture of me. I'm pointing of me seeing my name. Miss Moses. So I see my name. I drew a picture of me pointing to my name that I see. Okay, now we're going to tap out and write some sentences together and then you can draw a picture on your paper to match and I'll draw a picture up here to match, but we'll do the reading together. Okay, so first we need to find our sight words. You look at the sentence and think, what are the sight words in this sentence? I see two, do you see the two sight words? Great, I'll box them. That one says I, say I. That one says my, say my. Great, so we have I and my. We'll read those other words. Some of those words have an E at the end, so that means we'll have to say the long vowel sound. Don't get tricked. Here we go. I, tap it out. W, A, V, wave. It's not wav, wave. Go back to the beginning. I, 
wave. Tap it out. At. At. Back to the beginning. I wave at my. Tap it out. M. Mm, ah. Uh, mm, mom. Back to the beginning. Read the whole thing. You can do it. I wave at my mom. Great job. So what should we draw a picture of that matches that sentence? Yeah, we should draw a picture of ourselves waving at our mom. So fun. I'll draw on my paper, you draw on yours. Yay, I drew a picture of me waving at my mom. My picture matches my sentence. I hope your picture matches your sentence. I wave at my mom. Let's read another sentence together. You find those sight words. I see two sight words in this sentence. Got them? Let's look. Say she. Good. Say the. Very good. So we have she and the. Remember that she is when we're talking about girls or women. He is when we're talking about men or boys. So she. Here we go. She. Tap it out. Mmm. A. D. Made. Made. Back to the beginning. She. Made. The. Tap it out. B. A. D. Bed. Back to the beginning. Whole thing. You can do it. She made the bed. Great job. Now we need to draw a picture of a girl or a woman making the bed. Let's draw our pictures. You draw yours, I'll draw mine. Okay, I drew a picture of the girl making the bed. She made the bed. So now I'm going to have you tap out and read the sentences by yourself. I'll point, you tap and read. Now you're going to read the sentence all by yourself and draw a picture to a match. I'll point, you read. First, I'll tell you the sight words. This is the sight word we, this is the sight word a. The other two words you'll have to tap out by yourself. Both of the other words end in an E, so you'll have to make the long vowel sound. Make sure you say A when you're reading. Okay, get started reading. I'll point. One more time. Great job reading. Draw a picture to match. Okay, kindergartners, you did such a good job reading that last sentence by yourself. I will post some more sentences on Class Dojo that you can practice reading by yourself and you can draw pictures to match. You can either print out the paper and draw those pictures right on that paper, or you can just read the sentence from the screen or you could copy the sentence from the screen and then just draw a picture. Whatever works for you. Let's see if we met our objective. We said that students will be able to read sentences and draw a picture to match. We did that. Great job. And some of these words had silent E in them. They just, they weren't just words that ended in a consonant. They had silent E. I didn't trick you. Great job. Okay, bye for now.